Hi, I'm Eric Dodds from Rudderstack, and today we're briefly going to talk about the modern data stack. If we rewind 10 to 20 years and we look at the data systems that companies used, they tended to be pretty large, self-contained systems, often that ran on premises. This meant that a lot of the pieces of the puzzle were contained within the same platform. So you have a database and you run analytics on top of that database, and all of that's generally managed by an IT team. The modern data stack solved a major problem with those monolithic systems. And that was that IT became a gigantic bottleneck for use cases like marketing or product, right? Let's say a team wants to run a particular email campaign or a product team wants to analyze the adoption of a new feature. With old monolithic data systems, everything depended on the IT team going to the system, getting the data, modeling it, and then giving that user access to that data in some form of BI tool. That created a lot of challenges for teams who wanted to move fast. The initial response to that was the explosion of what we call the MarTech landscape. MarTech stands for marketing technology. What was this? Well, it was really the response of innovative people to the limitations and bottleneck of IT. That wasn't IT's fault. They just didn't have the tools to be able to deliver the what those business teams needed really fast. So a bunch of SaaS solutions popped up. If you think about web analytics tools, product analytics tools, A-B testing tools, all of these were purpose-built to solve these specific problems for teams who wanted to ship use cases on web analytics and A-B testing really fast. Now, that helped those business teams move really fast, but it created a huge problem and that was fragmentation of data across the entire stack. All of a sudden, you have all these individual teams using their individual tools. So one benefit of the monolithic system was that all the data lived in one place, and so you could actually answer questions across the entire data set because it all lived in one place. The explosion of the MarTech landscape and the explosion of the landscape for other tools and customer success and product caused extreme fragmentation. What did this mean? Ultimately, it meant that businesses had a much harder time answering difficult questions about their own business. Why is that? Well, the web team could answer questions about the website. The product team could answer questions about the product. The subscriptions team could answer questions about subscription revenue. But none of them could actually answer questions about how web usage, product usage, and subscription data related together. But those are really the questions that unlock growth for a business. The modern data stack solves this problem by placing the data store back at the center, but in a way that overcomes the challenges of monolithic systems. The center of the modern data stack is a modern cloud data warehouse or data lake. These are not on-prem systems, they're accessible in the cloud. They also integrate directly with all of these different systems. Instead of having to build custom pipelines and custom integrations, it's very easy to get data into and out of a modern cloud data warehouse or data lake. What does this mean? What does running the modern data stack mean? Well, it means that you can easily ingest data from all of the systems that all of those teams are using. You can get the web usage data. You can get the product usage data. You can ingest data from your CRM, from your marketing automation tool, from your payment system, and rebuild that single source of truth that they had back in the days of the monolith. This is hugely important. Even for simple analytics use cases, you can answer much more complex questions about your business. Even more importantly for business teams though, they can work from a single source of truth. Modeling that data in a modern cloud data warehouse or data lake allows you to build a comprehensive view of your business. A really common use case for this is something like a customer 360 or a golden customer record. All of the data from all those platforms I just talked about need to be combined to get a complete view of the customer journey and all of the traits that represent your customers. If you do that in the cloud data warehouse, you have a single source of truth, but because it's easy not only to pull data in, but to push data out, you can sync that single source of truth or that customer 360 to all of the downstream systems where business users are driving customer experiences. This is huge. The data team can control a single source of truth very tightly in the data warehouse, and they can push it to the business teams 
who all need to read from the, the same sheet of music. This is really the essence of the modern data stack, re-centralizing data in a single place, but not asking anyone to sacrifice their ability to move fast in their own tool. 